podcast host Transistor launched yesterday, offering hosting, analytics, and distribution for folks who are using podcasts to build their brand and grow their audience. It became number one on Product Hunt yesterday. They've also added an article on how to find an idea for your show. If you've got a podcast job you want promoting, we can help. If you mail your job to updates at podnews.net, you'll get free inclusion in a new thing that is coming soon. Simplecast has a sneak preview of the all-new Simplecast with a bunch of new tools. It goes live in September. Stitcher is looking for applicants for their Breakthrough Fellowship program. It's a paid position lasting four months in New York or Los Angeles. Matt Cundill posts a good set of notes from Podcast Movement 2018. Macmillan have launched The Girls in a complement to a book by Courtney Summers called Sadie. Both the book and the podcast apparently uniquely com- complement each other and drive the audience back and forth. How do NPR's podcasts win engagement for brands? You'll find out in a video interview that we've linked to today with uh, Brian Moffat, who is COO of National Public Media, taped at Podcast Movement. Stephen Goldstein also posts why so few people listen to podcasts on smart speakers and how to fix that. And David Hooper of Big Podcast has released a new podcast, Podcast Interviewing School, posting an episode a day in August. It teaches you how to grow your podcast, better connect with listeners, and spread your message.